After using many of these onions, I needed to dehydrate the rest. This variety did not have a long storage ability. I cleaned, cut, and chopped them so that I could put them in the dehydrator. I spread the onions out on parchment paper and until they were crisp. They release pretty easy, as you can see. Then I use my blender and put it on the chopping setting. And I just kept blending it until I reached the consistency or the way that I wanted it. I was gonna do powder, but I think I like the flakes better. In April, I planted these seeds indoors in my garage. These seeds were sent to me by the New Orleans gardener, Miss Linda, and they turned out beautiful. Look at that beautiful, beautiful color. I am so happy and proud to see this. I will be using it for tea, and it is just a beautiful color. I dehydrated them, and I got about a half a jar, which is plenty. This one turned out so beautiful. I planted beans in it and peppers, and it is full. Here are some of the yellow beans, and I got a pretty good harvest. And these are West Indian habaneros. This is my beautiful one covered in impatient flowers. This came out so nice and is so colorful in the yard. It is stunning. And of course, you know I had to add coleus to give it some nice standout pow. And, and these really did. I planted these from seed. On my deck this year, I tried something new. I had all of my tomatoes out there on, on the porch there, and I let them finish ripening, and it worked out pretty good. I just covered them, and I dried some herbs also. I covered the tomatoes, and um, they ripened pretty fast. At the top, yellow and green zucchini shredded. In the black bin, I have some poblano chilies cut up, ready for the freezer. Right next to that, some green bell peppers chopped. The next row, I have jalapenos and Mad Hatter peppers. A few banana peppers and yellow wax green beans. On the bottom, there are yellow pineapple tomatoes, black creme, and paste tomatoes. My freezer for all of my garden produce is just about full, so I will be canning very soon.